You want to go, little zebra fish? Let's do this. I saw the way you were looking at me. You thought, maybe I can take on that cuttlefish. Maybe I can eat that cuttlefish. Uh-uh. This cuttlefish is not getting eaten by zebras today. Zebra fish, that is. Because that would be weird if a zebra was eating a cuttlefish. <laughs> everybody i am kindly keen and welcome back to fish feed and grow as you can see update 0.8.4 has hit and they've added the cuttlefish as a playable creature which is really really cool you can also see they've added a new area to the survival map it has like these cool tiki head men yeah look at them they're so cool looking we can swim inside of their mouths hopefully they don't chomp down and eat us but yeah the update looks like a lot of fun so let's jump in all right so here's the cuttlefish you can see his base stats his health is 29 damage is 2 which is actually pretty good uh it could be better but it's decent but the real cool thing about the cuttlefish is his abilities now he has this thing called hypnos if the cuttlefish does not move before attacking it begins to rapidly alter its skin color causing potential prey to look at it and be drawn in it's like a tractor beam which is really really cool that's what happened to us a couple of times when we were playing i think as the sea turtle the cuttlefish would start doing that crazy thing with all their colors and we'd be like pulled in it was crazy and then of course we also have the ink burst which allows us to escape from predators when they attack us so i am very excited to play as the cuttlefish let's do it you can also see this little guy here swimming past our camera here that is the nautilus and that is also a new creature in the game now he's not actually playable but he's still pretty cool he'll be floating around hopefully we can check him out a little bit later but now let's begin our life as the adorable baby cuttlefish I really oh my gosh look at this little guy oh he's so cute I love it oh man that's so good mama cuttlefish over here she's just taking down that crab oh my gosh getting in a crazy fight can we have some of this meat mama please please leave me leave me some thank you thank you mama that was very nice of you Thank you very much. I'm going to eat it up. That was delicious. All right. This is going to be a lot of fun. Now, I'm not sure if we get the tractor beam ability. Oh, man. There's a hammerhead shark over there. I don't want to hang out over there. But now, I don't know if we get the tractor beam ability until we grow up into an adult. Probably because you think about it as a little baby cuttlefish, you probably don't want animals coming towards you. You want to avoid any kind of interaction with things that can eat you. So we don't want to tractor beam guys into us because then we'll get eaten by them. That seems like a terrible survival strategy. So let's avoid doing that. And let's just focus on eating these little guys off the ground and just just getting ourselves into adulthood now it shouldn't take too long because it looks like we only need three levels in order to get to adulthood so that's not too bad there's our brothers and sisters they're chewing up some bits of sea urchin for us thank you pals take it get a little bit of that hey 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 that was my, oh did, am i i'm i'm a i'm an adult i'm an adult cuttlefish now this is cool all right i like this can we take down this crab don't you dare run off that ledge. No, don't you go any deeper. You're not allowed, crab. Come here. Let's do this. Bring it on, buddy. Bring it on. You don't stand a chance, crabby. We got him. He's dead. He is super, super dead. All right, eat up that meat. Yeah, that's good. That's some delicious crab meat. So being that we are an adult, should we uh, make some cuttlefish babies? Let's, let's do it. Let's get to it. All right, I got four eggs, five eggs, eight eggs. Awesome. Let's start our cuttlefish family. Uh, I guess we can go up here. Yeah, this seems pretty safe. Famous last words. All right, let's lay some cuttlefish eggs. There we go. Why are baby cuttlefish so much cuter than adult cuttlefish? Like seriously, the adult cuttlefish is just hideous. He is so ugly. Look at that face. It's awful. He looks like the guy from Pirates of the Caribbean. Remember he had the tentacles from his face? Was that Davy Jones? He looks like Davy Jones. But the baby cuttlefish are adorable. Look at them. They're so cute. It's weird. It's very weird. Here you guys go. Come on. Eat up the starfish. Yeah, get in on that. That's some good stuff right there. All right, my cuttlefish army. Where are we going to go now? I don't actually know. I guess we can go and try to find that new area. That might be a cool thing to try and find. So they mentioned that it's beyond the ruins. 
Now that doesn't help me too much because I don't really know where the ruins are on this map. But let's just kind of swim around and try to find these tiki heads because I want to see them up close and personal. And along the way, we'll feed all our adorable little cuttlefish babies so that they can turn into really ugly adult cuttlefish. You guys should just stay adorable forever. But the problem is, is that you'll probably get eaten if you stay adorable forever. So maybe that's not such a good idea. Okay, there's a hammerhead shark just below us tearing up a fish. I don't want to be next on its menu, so let's just avoid the hammerhead shark. All right, we got some, like, pixie dust over here, guys. Eat up this stuff. I mean, it's actually probably plankton, but I like calling it pixie dust. Don't judge me. All right, this looks like ruins. Now, if I've learned anything about hanging out over here, it's that sharks tend to like hanging out over here, and I don't want to get eaten by a shark. I don't know about you little guys. But I don't want to get eaten by a shark. Maybe you guys do want to get eaten by a shark. I certainly don't. Oh, one of them grew up. We got an adult cuttlefish. There he is. We got two adult cuttlefish. That's pretty good. All right, guys. Eat it up. Eat it up. But mama needs to eat, though. Leave some food for mama. She's getting hungry. Okay, let, let's try our, our, our secret ability. Let's try it out here. Let's see if we can attract some prey. So do we just... We, oh, look at that. Look at that. He's coming over here. He can't resist. He cannot resist the allure of the cuttlefish. Attack! Attack! Oh, this was a bad idea. This was a terrible idea. Babies, help me! Oh, gosh. Oh, they're all attacking. Okay, okay. You know what? Let's leave. Let's leave. Ink! Ink spray! Do the ink spray. Oh, no. My babies. My babies are getting eaten. Okay, the zebra fish. Bad idea. Shouldn't have attacked the zebra fish. But that was pretty cool. How I tractor beamed him into my mouth. All right, I need to eat up because I need health. Thank you. Okay, so we only have one more baby cuttlefish left, which is really sad. That's just the way it goes. There's a shark. Sure enough, like I said, sharks love hanging out in ruins for whatever reason. Oh, man, there's a lot of them. Okay, let's just go over here. Okay, I don't know if this is a great idea. This was probably a terrible decision on my part, but I really want to find the tiki people. Oh my gosh, that is a huge, huge shark. Is that a megalodon? I think that's a megalodon. Probably don't want to mess around with the megalodon. Seems like it would be a poor life choice to pick a fight with a megalodon as a cuttlefish. Oh, I got two babies. I thought I only had one. Well, I'm glad you guys survived. We're on a hunt, though. We are on a hunt to try and find the new tiki statues. Whoa, what is this? Is this new? I don't remember seeing this volcanic stuff over here. This is cool. Now, if this isn't new, I've never seen it. So it's new to me. Let's grab a starfish. I need something to eat. Mama's hungry. Oh no. Oh no, my babies are dying. What, what happened? What was attacking them? Oh, Megalodon. Come on, you guys. Just, just follow me. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, there's a big boy over there. That's right. Use your ink effectively. Oh, check it out. It's Nautilus. There he is. He's so cool looking. Hey, buddy. What's going on, dude? We're like cousins or something. We both have the weird, ugly eyes. I don't know if I want to fight with him. He looks like he could actually kill me. So I'm not going to mess around with the Nautilus, but maybe we'll fight with the Nautilus later after we grow up a little bit more. Let's try to attract a dory to us. Yeah, you can't resist me. <laughs> that was awesome. That is really, really cool. I like the idea of being able to make fish come to you instead of having to chase them down. Because sometimes that can get real annoying. It's hard when the fish zip around you and you can't keep up with them. We got our last baby to adulthood, so that's pretty sweet too. I really, really like that power. That is cool. Let's do the same thing to Nemo. You can't resist, Nemo. Nemo, come here. Come here. Come here, buddy. The colors, they're so beautiful. You can't resist the colors. Why are you resisting the colors? The Nemos can resist my allure? This isn't fair. Come here. Yeah, you can't resist. Come here, buddy. Come here, you're going down. Oh, chew him up. Chew him up. There we go. Oh, there's a Megalodon over there. I've made a terrible decision in staying here. This was a bad choice. I need to leave. All right. This looks kind of new-ish, right? Ooh, there's baby dories. I'm sorry, baby dories. Come here. Come here. Don't fight the colors. Don't fight it. Embrace it. Embrace it. Yes. Oh, you're dead. You're dead. You're all dead. 
you're all going down. Oh, I almost feel bad about this, but I don't. Come here, little guys. Come here. Yes, come to me. <laughs> that is so cool. Oh, man, I love this guy. This makes hunting fish way, way easier. As long as they can't eat you back, this is really, really effective. I like this a lot. Chew them up. Level up. Level seven. Let's go. Nicely done, my little cuttlefish. Nicely done. All right, so our hunt for the tiki statues continues. This seems kind of interesting. There's like a little cave over here. What? Where does this take us? This is pretty cool. All right, this is actually looking kind of promising. Still no tiki statues, but this is a cool little area. I like it a lot. Oh, tiki statue. I see the mouth off in the distance. There it is. All right, we found it. We found the new area. There's the awesome Tiki Man. We can go inside of his mouth. We can just hang out in here forever. Actually, you can't do that because you would starve to death. So let's not stay here forever, but I like it. I like my little mouth house. So are there more Tiki statues or is it just that one? This looks kind of, oh, whoa. Yes, there are definitely more Tiki statues. Look at this thing. This one's big. This is huge. This is like a little cave. We could live here. I like this. I like this area too, because it's quiet. There's no animals trying to eat me over here, which is very, very nice. There's another one. Look at how happy that guy is. He's just so happy that we found him. I'm happy that I found you too, buddy. I'm happy that I found you too. Is this another one? Oh my gosh, this one is really big too. Let's go above the water and see if we can catch a glimpse of him above the water. Yeah, that's a pretty big statue there. Uh-oh, we've got some barracudas over here. I don't think I can take on a barracuda. That's asking for trouble. That's definitely asking for trouble. Oh yeah, oh uh, yeah, no, I don't wanna mess around with the barracudas. Oh gosh, they're gonna chase me. No, don't chase me. Please don't notice me. I inked him. I inked him. That ink is super effective. Did you see that? As soon as I hit it, he immediately turned around, went the other direction. That is awesome. There's another very happy statue. I'm glad that you guys are so happy to be underwater forever. Let's continue leveling this guy up because this is a really, really cool creature to play as. This is so cool. I'm so glad that we can actually play as the cuttlefish now because when they first introduced the cuttlefish, I thought it was a really, really neat addition but I was bummed out that you couldn't actually play as it. So the fact that we can play as it now is awesome. I'm, I'm super excited about this. I just wanna keep leveling up. Let's see, what do we got down here? We got Nemos. Let's eat the Nemos. Come here, Nemos. Come here, little guys. Oh yeah, you guys are getting chewed up. You guys are getting chewed up and you can't run away because you're just so attracted to my beautiful colors. It's your worst nightmare. You can't, you can't get away. You can't escape. I'm too beautiful. I am the most beautiful fish on the planet. That was a shark. That was a shark. Oh gosh. Yep, hello Megalodon. I'm leaving now. I'm sorry that I interrupted your feeding time. I'm just gonna go over here, okay? Oh, he's coming over here. Oh gosh. No, 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 don't you dare. Don't you dare come over here. Ink, ink him, ink him forever. Get the heck out of here. Oh my gosh. That megalodon, he's scary. Let's eat this yellow fish. Come here, butterfly fish, come here. <laughs> I love it. They just swim right into my mouth. It's so perfect. This is fantastic. I love you, cuttlefish. You're my favorite. Oh, these poor little butterfly fish. They can't escape. They've moved too close to the predator. There's a lot of barracudas around here and I don't like it because I can't eat them yet. Maybe one day I can eat them, but for now, I can't eat them. I do want to try and take on a Nautilus, although it may not let me eat a Nautilus because we're almost the same species. I don't actually know how that all works. Let's take down this crab. Come here, buddy. Come here. This is going to be good food. There's a bunch of crab around here, so let's eat up these guys as quickly as we can. Yeah, these guys are really, really good XP. There's more. Come here. <laughs> oh, buddy. You're going down. You cannot escape the mighty cuttlefish. This thing is so, so cool. Let's, let's attract them to us. Come to me, my pretties. Yes. Gather around. Dance for me. Dance for me, crabs. The cuttlefish power is really getting to my head. All right, now I'm gonna eat you guys. I'm sorry, not really, but I am. 
but not really. You guys are delicious. You all are just delicious, delicious crab meat. Thank you so much. Thank you for sticking around. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you for turning into meat and eventually turning into my experience points. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's do it again. Let's attract all of them to us. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh, man. I feel like the Death Star in Star Wars. Got a big old tractor beam. Suck them in. There's no escape. Come here, guys. Come here. You know you want to. There we go. And I love that we can hit more than one at a time. That is really, really cool. In case I haven't mentioned it, I really like the cuttlefish. Come here, octopus. Yes, enter my mouth and get eaten. All right, so we hit level 17. Now I want to see if we can take on one of these new nautilus. Now, I think that they were around here, but I'm not seeing any anymore. Here, Nautilus. Why does the Nautilus have to hang out where all the sharks are? I don't like this, but hopefully I can find some. They probably all got eaten by the sharks because they like to hang out over here. Probably a poor decision on your guys' part. You should you should move somewhere else. You really should move some. Oh, there they are. There they are. All right, let's see if we can take down a Nautilus. Come to me. Come to me. Yes, you cannot resist my beautiful colors. Come here. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yes, attack him. Get him. Take him down. Here we go. Here we go. This is awesome. This is fantastic. The ultimate invertebrate battle. Like, what subspecies are they a part of? Because they have a lot of similarities, right? They're part of the same species as squid, right? Am I wrong in that? I don't know, but man, I took that guy down no problem. He didn't even attack me. Maybe they're more docile than I thought. But they make for some awesome XP. If I can take down these guys that easily, I can get a lot of great XP here. Let's do it. They don't stand a chance. I almost feel bad. He's just like super dead. Took this guy down. I also, I learned something. So, cuttlefish are cephalopods. That is the subspecies that they're a part of. And Nautiluses are a part of that same species. So they're all cephalopods, including octopus and squid. So that's pretty cool. I knew they were related somehow, but now I actually know. They're cephalopods. So we're kind of eating our own family, which is sort of messed up. But also, you guys are just great for XP. You make for excellent, excellent XP. And you don't fight back. And I'm sorry to be doing this to you because you are kind of cute in a weird, gross way. But you're, the XP is just too good. I can't pass it up. All right, there we go. We turned him into meat. Let's chew up this bit a little bit more. Look at that. Level 20 cuttlefish. He's getting big. He's getting real big. I wonder if we can get revenge on the zebra fish that ate our babies before. Oh, no. There's a swordfish chasing me. Get the heck out of here. Oh, that Nautilus is super, super dead. He's getting eaten by tiger sharks. Not a fun way to go. Trust me. I've been there. I've been there. There's a zebra fish. Come here. Come here. You dumb zebra fish. Yeah, you can't escape. I pulled you in with my tractor beam powers, and now I'm going to chew you up. Oh, they don't stand a chance anymore. I've become too powerful. You should have killed me when you had the chance, but you let me go, and this is what you get. Sweet, sweet revenge. He's done. He's roasted and toasted. Look at that XP. Oh, my gosh. That zebra fish was worth a lot of XP. That was awesome. You want to go? You want to go, little zebra fish? Let's do this. I saw the way you were looking at me. You thought, maybe I can take on that cuttlefish. Maybe I can eat that cuttlefish. Uh-uh. This cuttlefish is not getting eaten by zebras today. Zebra fish, that is. Because that would be weird if a zebra was eating a cuttlefish. Yeah, that's right. You're dead. You're dead. I'm sorry. It, it, being a cuttlefish really brings out the worst in me. Not so kindly, am I? Level 22. What now? What now? There is a hammerhead shark down here. Would I be able to take on a hammerhead shark as a cuttlefish? Probably not. This is a bad, bad decision. Okay, you know what? Ink him. Ink him. Get away. Get away. Let go of me, you stupid hammerhead shark. Oh, no. Oh, it all, it all is going down. It's all, oh, my 
gosh, why would I make a stupid decision like that? You can't take on a hammerhead shark as a cuttlefish. It's a shark, for goodness sake. Come on, why would you do that? Well, there's my meaty bits, and he's eating it up and absorbing the XP from that, so congratulations to you, hammerhead shark. We did do a pretty good number on him. I mean, he's torn up pretty good. He's probably had better days, but he survived, and I'm dead. I gotta say, playing as the cuttlefish was a lot of fun. He is a really, really cool animal to play as. Super, super fun. I love the tractor beam ability and the ability to run away with the ink shot. Oh man, it's real good stuff. But guys, I think that's gonna do it for this episode of Fish Feed and Grow. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. And of course, if you'd like to see more, you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on that little circle with my logo in it right below this window. You can also watch more of my videos by clicking on the sides of the screen. But that is going to do it. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.